One guy admitted to f- being part of 500 stolen cars just last year. Just one guy, 25 year old Kevin Reed III, a machine in the car theft game in Detroit. Kind of the middleman Instagram, you go steal this car, I'll give you a few bucks and then I'll sell it down here. 500 that he admitted to. One of two big fish arrested this month in grueling investigations by Detroit police organized crime. 10% of auto theft in the city of Detroit attributed to just two people. And unfortunately, there's more like them. Commander Eric Decker says it's staggering. The two men operating independent of each other accounted for 10% of the 9,600 stolen cars in Detroit last year. Reed, now charged with felonies, including conducting a criminal enterprise, sold stolen high-end cars across the country. They spent as much time in being a a thief as they did in something legitimate, they'd probably be very successful. And then there's big fish number two, Terry Williams, accused of being behind more than 300 car thefts here in the city of Detroit. He actually had a day job and at night, something a little shadier. This guy sleep or what? I mean, literally. Not very much. Williams M.O. a little different. The 31 year old was after catalytic converters sold for up to twelve hundred dollars a piece. Probably almost every day he'd go out and steal a car, uh, take it to another location, cut off the catalytic converter on it and then sell that. Williams racking up that criminal enterprise felony too. both have long criminal histories. Kevin Reed was given a personal bond currently on tether at home and Williams easily made his $5,000 cash bail. The commander says those bonds pale in comparison to the damage done. Hopefully when it comes around to the, the judges look at all that money, that millions of dollars, and actually bring the hammer down. And the commander promises this isn't over. Reporting in Detroit, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.